so we're going to play a two-player game. Uh, see, four players can play. Uh, I think that was one of the updates to this. Uh, oh, he's not joining in. Yeah, that's awesome. There we go. Condition. Uh, oh, letting me join. There we go. Got him. Uh, so yeah, four player people can play at the time. Hey, if you've Wallace not Wells. seen this, but you are familiar with uh, River City Girls or River City Rampage, this game is basically taken exactly from that. Floppy, you're going as Ramona, and Dan, you're going as Wallace. Wallace Wells. So Wallace. The only, oh, yeah. only thing I know funny. about Scott Pilgrim. I, I don't think he was in the last game. No, he wasn't. He's one of the brand new editions. I've, actually, he came out as DLC, I believe, um, as well as Knives' mum. Well, I don't even think he's in the movie <laughs> or the book that much. There was someone named Knives in the movie. That's the only thing I know about Scott Pilgrim. And there was the me film. just running backwards. Yeah. Uh, so it's oh, look, a basic uh, beat em up left to right scrolling adventure. The artwork is absolutely beautiful. But Dan, you were saying before you had an issue with the artwork. Yeah, Um. so I forgot to look it up now. This artwork is done by, I think, um, he's an animator. He, he, he came out, he did like thing called like Ninja Pirate Squid or, uh, or something like that. His, name's like, his last name's Robinson, I think. And he, 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 he's a YouTuber or he was back before YouTube. It was just back with like, you know, the new grounds and all shit like that. He um, would do pixel art and do these really long animations, like fighting sequences. And I'm pretty much 100% sure, 99% sure that he, this is his animation style. Like, the boss battles are so much like his. And and he's got a great style, and it's awesome, and it's beautiful. But I just feel it doesn't feel like Scott Pilgrim to me. Really? I reckon it looks really, really close to all the, um, the graphic novels. Yeah, I don't know. I just... It's Which, funny story, Dan actually recommended the graphic novels to me, and I read them because of Dan. So, full circle. Yes, full circle Ooh. indeed. Um, I'm just getting slammed Circle here. of life. Like, I keep looking at the wrong person. So this is basically a, um, a clone, for those who haven't played it, of uh, River City Rivals? R Gangs? Rampage. Rampage? <laughs> I can never remember what it's called. Well, there. It was called Street Gangs everywhere else. Or in Australia, at least. Yeah. And it's out in the NES. It's so, an expensive game now. Um, I find this game... This game's really hard, eh? Yeah, I mean, I think I've gotten up to Gideon Graves once. I used to have this on the Xbox 360. In fact, I still have it on my Xbox 360. Was it digital? Uh, it was digital. Uh, no physical copies came out, but there are physical physical copies. Oh, jeepers, creepers. There are physical copies coming out in approximately five hours from when we are streaming Ooh. this over on twitch.tv backslash hack the dino, which I know Braden and I have the site queued up, ready to jump on board. Oh, yeah. We thought it would be limited from limited run games, but apparently... They are just do it, taking pre-orders until a certain date and then filling those orders. Which is awesome. So we won't miss out. Oh, we'll um, show them once we're done with the gameplay. We get really, really cool things like uh, you get the Agama Anamagaguchi. Anamagaguchi. Thank you. Uh, soundtrack, which is really awesome. Oh. Uh, if you don't know who that is, a really popular chiptune um, band. I just bought it on vinyl. Oh, did you? Yeah. Literally uh, before the show. It is a great thing. You can uh, get just your physical copy. You can get a, a physical copy with a couple of um, uh, little extras like the uh, Clash at Demon Head uh, concert tickets and some stickers. You can get a diorama version where you open it up and they're all on stage rocking out. That looks awesome. It looks um, like a big vinyl case. I think Wallace, and then Wells, you open it up. The, Wallace Wells does a rainbow uppercut. Oh, I can pick stuff up. Uh, yeah, stop have, it. You've never played these games before. You played River City Girls. Uh, yeah, I've never played this game before. It's exactly the same. I'm River City Girls is easier. This game is really, really hard. Oh, I can pick the dude up. Yeah. And smash his face in the. Oh, yeah! In the puddle. Oh. Yeah, get it! That's oh. just snow, floppy. Yeah, I peed in that snow. Oh, that was cool. It interacted with the pin bag. Uh, yeah. So, great game. Everyone should drop everything after this show. Keep watching us and get it because this is a great game and we don't know how long it'll be on the store for. We assume it got... Uh, oh, no. <laughs> we assumed it got taken off the Xbox oh, and PlayStation 3 stores many, many years ago. Oh, my God. Because of licensing issues. Uh, and don't contact creator of Scott Pilgrim, Brian Lee O'Malley, about questions about this game because you absolutely no idea about anything and he will yell at you through Twitter because he's sick of hearing it. And I think he's sick of Scott Pilgrim as well. <laughs> Just does quiet. he hate his creation? Is he? He does. I think is he's, he Doctor Frankenstein? I, I think he is well over it. Uh, people have asked for a sequel and everything. He just goes no. Oh, no big story's combos. Done. Story, story is absolutely done. Uh, what do you think of the game so far, Floppy? I enjoy it, but I like, I like these things. Like it's uh, like I've just you know, I spent a little time playing Streets of Rage a little while ago. I downloaded River City Girls on Games Pass. So yeah, I enjoy it. River this City is Girls is wicked. Yeah. I will purchase this. Yeah. I'd like to get the physical copy. I hope they're still pre-ordering it for a few more days. Uh, there's actually a date, I can tell you. I still uh, think it's a little bit clunky. until the 
Uh, uh, end of February. There you go. I'm okay with that. I'll be fine. But they got shirts as well. Uh, you can get, as Dan said, the vinyl. You can get shirts. You can get switch cases. You can get enamel pins. Uh, you can get a trading card set. Well, I'm probably going to get that trading card set, truth be told. I've got a bloody bucket. What am I going to do with a bucket? It's all really, really cool. So head Look on it. over. If you're interested, uh, limitedrungames.com. Uh, Scott Pilgrim vs. The World is there. You can get that PS4 version or the Switch version. What Oof. happened? Really, really cool. Really looking forward to playing that as soon as I have internet. 